In the heart of the Barossa Valley, Nuriutpa High School offers students pathways into the wine industry through its Vines and Wines program. And the enthusiasm for the course on the part of both teachers and students is impressive. I grew up on a farm up in the mid-north of South Australia, up near Jamestown, so I guess farming has always been a passion. My first year at the school and really enjoying being a part of an agricultural team and a school that has such a significant program. This is a purpose-built uh, state-of-the-art winery. Uh, we are a state school, so we're very fortunate to have that built. We are running a commercial winery and have been for 27 years. Wine is a major employer for our students. Uh, it's a huge industry driver for the area, so it's imperative that we can give our students the introduction and experience into the wine industry. It's about exposing them to the industry, so they know there's options ranging from labour jobs to going into university pathways for wine making. It's a choice for students entering year 10, so our main role is to give students skills in wine making, and hopefully that gives them uh, a leg into getting employment in the industry. I live locally and studying the Vines and Wine program at the school at the moment and I'm working towards probably getting a job within the industry. My whole life my family's been working living on a vineyard so I've helped out my whole life and I've loved the idea of just everything changes throughout the year, no two years are the same. I'm studying chemistry, methods and agriculture and I'm working towards a viticultural agronomist. It's mostly the science behind growing grapes, essentially a vineyard. Things like soil testing, a lot of driving to and from vineyards to find out and test and help the vigneron to grow better grapes and create more profit. I'm an upcoming third generation grape grower, so I live on a property and I've always been from a little tacker, being out in the vineyard, helping dad wherever I can. I'm currently studying ag and chemistry and maths to all hopefully lead into a viticulture based future. There's a myriad of ways that students can enter the industry. Uh, some students begin while they're at school and as students in year 10, year 11 or year 12 and they might start beginning by doing Cert 2 or Cert 3 certificates in the industry. They can also follow through after school through RTOs or th go the tertiary pathway with university and things like that. And a lot of wineries that take on our students uh, will also facilitate further uh, education in the industry. I view our role at the school is to show the students all of those options and that there's no one way to enter the industry. We've had students who have gone on to be and still are winemakers, but we've also had students that have gone on to do school-based apprenticeships in viticulture. We've had students that go into making labels there are some there in the bottling process and all of those associated industries are what we're involved with in making of the wine. I'm a passionate believer in getting kids out into the industry so I love taking kids out to a cooperage for example and seeing how barrels are made, going to some of the big commercial wineries or even some of the smaller family wineries and, and just showing them the options of what's there, getting them onto a track deal. It's fantastic because it just opens their eyes to all the options that they can have. We have probably two thirds of our students that study agriculture at the school come, we would call them townies. They come from properties in the town. They don't have direct connections with being on the land. So we're really supported by the big wineries around the place like Yolumba and Treasury and things like that, where they are really keen to take students on that just have a passion. And we pull that out, clean it, put it back and go again. And when you get here, approximately five jobs for every graduate when it comes to agriculture. So there's a huge, huge demand for young talent to come into the industry and industry is definitely jumping on board and supporting that, whether they have experience or if they are just developing and showing an interest in that career. I would say passion, you have to be passionate in the wine industry. Being a lifelong learner, is very important. I'm a big believer in that as a teacher here at the school and good communication skills. So whether you're operational viticulture in a vineyard or even a winemaker, those communication skills will hold people in good stead, I believe, in the industry. Mm -hmm.